Ready for any? What was that? I hope that goes. I hope you put that on the camera. Ready, Freddy? <laughs> <laughs> Getting old. <laughs> Hey, Mike. Hey, man. What's up? We're here for a remastered review. Yeah. I've, I've actually never had this one. I have. Once. All right. We're going to try it out now. <laughs> we're going to try it now in a proper, in a proper sitting. Um, so what we have, this is Sam Adams' Boston Lager, but the remastered version. So Sam decided this year to um, remaster the Boston Lager recipe. And they said, all, I read an article that they said, always like be improving or whatnot. But I'm like, well, how do you improve on greatness is my question. Fair question. So we're going to give this a review, and then the following review, we're going to compare it to a uh, regular Sam that uh, I magically found at my friend Jeff's house. He was at, We were at a party, and I opened his cooler, and I was like, oh, how do you have this? And he goes, I just bought it at the store. And I, I've been looking. Every time I go everywhere, I think Sam took it off the shelves and they yeah, put it back. I agree. So it is July 21st. The, what we're going to do after this is one that said Best by June. So we're it, it's pretty close. And I've had pretty old Sam. They're still pretty delicious. Always. So the can, I mean, the bottle is the same except for, like it says, remastered on the top. I imagine they'll probably drop this in a year or so and just make and keep the Boston longer. Maybe. Is the idea, it was the idea always to keep it um like changing like, yeah oh like a rolling recipe oh maybe i don't know yeah who knows let's find out uh let's find out what we have in here anyway our tyler's pursuit of, an, of perfection has led to the remastered boston lager made easier drinking through decades of improvements the beer you love remastered because they even said sweeter or, or, or was the way they're going all right well, let's find out like, i mean it looks like boston lager right it does. It looks like a vienna yep it's just like almost amber copper kind of it got a nice Almost eggshell head. It's just over two fingers. I mean, in these glasses, this in like the nucleation point yeah. at the bottom. Like yeah. these are the Spiegel out Sam glasses. Yeah. See this guy. These are pretty. They are really per pretty glasses. I don't use them much though. I was gonna say I don't use them enough. I, I I use them sort of recently, but it was probably the first time in like a year because it's just I don't I don't guess I don't have that much Sam usually, and it's I'm like always you afraid. Drink of, oh, you always yeah breaking it. I'm always afraid of breaking them. Because I do still have my some regular glass ones. Yeah. And I usually use those if yeah. I can. So let's not get a nose. Do it. I mean, I... You know what? I'm just going to call it like it is. Instead, I was going to say, you know what? It's, I was going to start comparing. All right. Um, honestly, it, it got like some strong caramel. Yep. Uh, it has uh, almost like a cascade type um, grapefruit. Oh, yeah, uh, kind of point, nose, yeah. a little bit of pine. I mean, um, a hint of uh, of like cereal grains, almost like like uh, like kicks, kind of sweeter, kind of cereal grains, almost. Yeah, it has. It does have like that that malty or caramel profile. Yep. The hops do come through. Yep. Kind of like right, like a little bit. Um, subdued but but and that and that's not a comparison to the regular yeah. i mean just in general it does smell like a good beer though it does yeah and th this is the thing too is um this smells like a vienna it does that's what it smells like right let's get a taste cheers cheers bud honestly man, that's good it's good it's um the the body is a little lighter than I expected. Like the mouth feels like yep. it's um not that it's thin. It's not even that. It's just it's like lighter. It's not. It doesn't have a uh, the heft almost. Um, but one thing I, I didn't quite get in the nose that I'm getting very very much on the, the palate is like toasted bread. Yeah. Like like very much like 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 toasted white bread. That's actually yeah. a good pull. I'm getting a little bit of like. A lemoniness to it too, like a lemon rindiness, pithiness. Oh, I can see that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, hundred percent. Yeah. yeah. Wow. It's yeah. So I've already I've had this, and I think this is, and this is why I wanted to do this, like this, because like when I had it, I was being a little critical, but I wasn't being this critical. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. Like how we normally really dissect it. Yeah. 
And the thing is, when I say that I'm, when I, if I'm by myself, I say I'm being critical, that means I'm being a dick. Yeah. You know? <laughs> this is really refreshing. It's actually really nice. I like it, it has a nice bite to it. It is, um, it, 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 it does have a, a higher level of, uh, of sweetness than, than most Viennas, I would think, but. I don't think so. I don't, I don't think, think so. so. No. I, I, I think there's a, there's an element of, of like caramel stuff like, it, it is caramelly in that way, but I don't think it's particularly sweet. I was honestly, I didn't come in here with biases, but I assume this is going to be sweet and horrible. <laughs> it's a pleasant surprise. Yeah. It, um, what it is, what it is, is um, it's actually pretty easy to drink. I, I had to buy a six pack. I couldn't find any singles and I was getting a little annoyed with it. These won't be a, a bad way to finish. I wouldn't mind drinking these. No. Um, it, it is, it, I think that. Uh, the hops are actually nicely um, balanced in here. Yep. I I like how toasty it is. It does have a nice like toasted toasted lager, like not like blue point toasted lager, like that's yeah. what people would think of, like but like it does, it is it's, it's subtle enough, but it it it, it's, it it lets you know it's there. Yeah, it's nice. Uh, I I and honestly, like man, the mouthfeel is kind of doing it for me. It's like it's like it's just it's. Not champagne-y. I don't mean like light and effervescent, but it's just like, it's like softer. It's pretty soft on the palate in yeah. a good way. I, honestly, I'm pretty, I'm pleasantly surprised. Yeah. I'm, lie, Sean. I'm, 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 I'm happier now after getting to finally dissect it. it. Like it is super refreshing. Like I want to keep drinking this. Yeah. But, but we need something for the next video. And. Dude, the, and you're not kidding. That lime is, no, not lime, that lemon. Yeah. It's, like, wow. Like, I, I can't believe that I didn't get that right away. Yeah. Now it's all I'm thinking about when I think in a good way though. This is like I I always I always love Sam. I feel like this will be just a nah, I'm already comparing, but it doesn't matter. This will be just a little bit better for like um like those days you're mowing your lawn. It's just slightly more refreshing. That's all. It's not that it's better. It's not that it's worse. I'm not yeah, saying yeah, yeah. that, but it's just I think that little bit of like that citrus rind yep. and it just just a touch lighter. I think it's actually going to be, it's much more like something that while well, I'm mowing the lawn, I'm like, oh, I can grab one of those. That, that doesn't seem like a bad idea. Yeah. Yeah. Just no, put that a, out there. That's a good, that's a good, that's a good poll. Um, yeah. Down in the comments, Sam Remastered, what do you think of, what do you think of compared to the other Sam? But don't forget to click the link somewhere over here that we'll have to the um, comparison video um, to see what we think of it when we compare it to a old version of Sam Adams. And if did Sam Adams mess up? I, like given this, they could have been complimentary maybe, but. We're going to find out. Only one way to find out. Nerdsense.net, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, those are things. Like, comment, subscribe, those notification bells so you can find me posting new videos. I'm Sean. I'm Mike. And, and this, this is Nerdsense. Nerd